bit of jewelry for your journey home. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I killed the people of the... Now they're going to die for now. my... By the Divines, the Forsworn are here in the city! Everyone stay back. The Markor city guard have this all out... ...control. There are no Forsworn here. What do you need? By the gods, that man nearly killed me. You saved my life. Thank you. Here. I was gonna bring this to my sister, but I think you should have it. Oh, damn. Another body to get rid of. No. I don't have any idea. I was just shopping for a pendant for my sister back in the Imperial City. <clears throat> I've heard of them. Something about the men who live in the hills and attack caravans. I'm sorry. I don't know anymore. I'm just visiting here from Cyrodiil. Good day. We'll handle things from here. Move along. I said move along. The Forsworn are just a bunch of madmen. We have everything under control. Stay out of it. All right, then. He... he tried to kill Margaret. Right in front of me. No. She's such a nice woman. Comes by every day looking for jewelry for her family in Cyrodiil. Is it because she's a noble? Why would anyone want to kill her? It doesn't make any sense. What's Gods. happening to this city? A woman attacked right on the streets. Are you all right? Did you see what happened? A Forsworn? Strange. Well, I hope the Eight give you more peace in the future for what it's worth. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. My note? No, that's yours. Must have fallen out of your pocket. I'd better get going. Yes? Oh! Uh, I don't feel any different. What did you do? I'm sorry to drag you into Markarth's problems, but after that attack in the market, I'm running out of time. You're an outsider. You're dangerous looking. You'll do. You want answers? Well, so do I. So does everyone in the city. A man goes crazy in the market. Everyone knows he's a forsworn agent. Guards do nothing. Nothing but clean up the mess. This has been going on for years, and all I've been able to find is murder and blood. I need help. Please, you find out why that woman was attacked, who's behind Wayland and the forsworn, and I'll pay you for any information you bring me. She's not from Markarth. The air about her screamed outsider. Visitors to the city usually stay at the Silverblood Inn. He was one of the smelter workers. I used to have a job down there myself, casting silver ingots. I never knew much about Whalen, except he lives in the Warrens, like all the other workers. Yes, it all started when I was a boy. My father owned one of the mines. 
rare for anyone who isn't a Nord. He was killed. Guards said it was just a madman, but everyone knew the murderer was a member of the Forsworn. I've been trying to find out why ever since. Gotten nowhere so far. And then I got married. I have a child of my own on the way. I swore I was going to just give up for my child's sake, but it's like my father's ghost is haunting me, asking me why. Let me know as soon as you found anything. So you don't know anything about this house? No. Anyone seen entering or leaving? Any strange oh, lights or unusual noises? Give me noises? some meat, you fat nord. It's abandoned. Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink this and clean rooms. This is an old rooms. Skyrim staunch protector. This is the Silverblood Inn. Ah, yes. Rented the nicest room we had for a whole month. I think she's sitting by the fire. We Poor girl. to our youth. Today is come and gone for the age of aggression. Remember, ale is cheaper done. than blood in Markar. How are your chores coming, son? We'll drive out. I've been cleaning up spills, and, and there is fresh one. Dizzy from everything. Too lazy to give him a drink just we'll visiting. I had some business home. here. That's all. Another drink. Home. Down with Ulfric, the killer of kings, on the day of your death. Was it that obvious? We'll Damn. We'll I must be losing my touch. I'm one of General Tullius' agents. I was sent to investigate the Treasury House and the Silverblood family. They own Sidna Mine, one of the toughest jails in Skyrim. I was hoping I could buy or steal the deed, but I don't think that's how things work here. Mark my words, Thonar Silverblood was behind that attack in the market. Somehow. You want a drink? Unlike my husband, Clapper, I watch after our guests. I'm what you'd call a soldier of fortune. Make me an offer. Nothing, you pig headed oaf. Well, what am I supposed to do? Never leave the house? You want that ending? You're closing this stall, and that's final. You Excuse me, but do you know anything about this house? Seen anyone? Thank you for your time. The I'm s I'm afraid he's asked not to be disturbed. He has important business. Go. Go right ahead, then. Don't let me keep you. I have records I need to tend to. You just let old Nana know if you need anything. All right, dear? I'm married to Thonar Silverblood. Keep that in mind while you're speaking to me. What are you doing here? I told them no visitors. The Imperial agent? That's right, I knew. How many dogs is the Empire going to send after me? This is my business, my city. You Empire lovers should learn to stay out of it. Now get out! By the first one. What? By the gods, Petrus! Come here. Where'd you come from? No. Ha! We are routed. Fall back. Look what you made me do. Oh well. My wife. They killed him. Damn Madanok. Damn his forsworn backside. Fine. You want to know what the Force One really are? They're my puppets. I have their king rotting in Sidna Mine. He was supposed to keep them under control.
When their uprising was crushed, I had Madanak brought to me. He was a wild animal, but a useful one. I offered him a stay from execution if he used his influence to deal with any annoyances that came up. Competitors, agents, idiots. So I've let him run his little forsworn rebellion from inside Sidna mine. Now he's out of control. Madanach, the king in rags. While we were off fighting the elves in the Great War, Madanach was busy ruling over the Reach. Until Ulfric came and put them down. You already got what you wanted, you damn hound. This is your fault. You and Madanach are animals, and I'll see you both rot to death in Sidna Mine for this. Now get out of my house! Can I help you? I'm warning you. Back off! Stop! By order of the Yard, stop right there. All right, but you just watch yourself. Next time, I might not be so lenient. You don't want to be here. No one wants to. You've been digging around where you don't belong. It's time you learned a lesson. Someone who doesn't like you asking questions. Come on. Let's see what you're made of. A fight! 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 Uh, 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 I'll fix 
tricks you good. You won't get away from me. Come on! This what you want? This should be good. Who taught you to fight? Yeah. You're just gonna stand there and take it? Yeah. Back! Yeah. I'll get you! Yeah. Who taught you to fight? Keep those hands up! I'm getting You're out just of gonna here. stand there and take it? Boy, yeah. yeah! Drive that snow back to the ground! Come on! Uh, you mangy piece of pit bait! I was sent by Nepos the Nose. The old man hands out the orders. He told me to make sure you didn't get in the way. That's all I know, I swear. Don't like those eyes you got. There's a bad hunger to them. They don't like us talking to people when we work. be a silversmith one day, like my mother and father. Excuse me. What's your business here? We haven't been expecting you and the old man needs his rest. Come back some other time. Wait. It's okay, my dear. Send her... Hmm? <laughs> yes, Nepos. You heard him. Go on in. I'm sorry about my housekeeper. She's a little protective of me. Now, what is it you want? Ah, yes. You've proven to be a real bloodhound. Well, you've sniffed me out. I've been playing this game for almost 20 years. Sending the young to their deaths. All in the name of the Force Woman. And I'm tired. So tired. My king, Maranach. When the uprising fell at the hands of the Nords, they threw him in the mines. I don't know how, but he lives. I get his messages, and I hand out his orders without question. Markarth and the Reach are our lands. That is why we are the Forsworn. We cannot claim the home that is rightly ours. But then, during their war with the Elves, we had our moment. We drove the Nords out of the Reach in a great uprising. Then Ulfric and his men came. Those of us who didn't run were executed, except for myself, my king, and a handful of others. 
My dear girl, what makes you think you're getting out of here alive? You were seen coming in. The girl at the door is a Forsworn agent masquerading as a maid. You aren't the first one to have gotten this far. You won't be the last. I'm sorry. Who's there? But Just a scratch! We warned you, but you had to just go and cause trouble. Now we have to pin all these recent murders on you. Silence witnesses. Work, work, work. We have a nice arrangement in this city, and we're not letting you get in the way. You have a problem with that. Take it up with Madanach. I'm sure the King in Rags and his Forsworn would love to meet you. Now you're coming with us. It's a life sentence that's in the mind for you. You'll never see the sun again, you hear me? No one escapes Sidna mine. No one. All right, prisoner. Eyes front. You're in Sidna mine now, and we expect you to earn your keep. There's no resting your hide in a cell in this prison. Here you work. You'll mine ore until you start throwing up silver bars. You got it? Don't get smart with me. I'm in charge. You keep it up, I'll have your toes cut off. All right, open her up. Now you, get down there. What are you in for, new blood? Violent one, huh? Best keep that to yourself, new blood. Others find out, they'll consider that a challenge. My advice? Serve your time at the pickaxe and get out. You don't want to end up getting a shiv in the guts over a bottle of skooma. If you're asking, that means you're the new lifer. Tough luck, friend. Those guards sold you out, but good. No one talks to Madinak, I'm afraid. Not without getting past Borkel the Beast. And you don't want to talk to Borkel the Beast. Now, if you'll excuse me. The new meat. So soft. Tender. What was it like killing your first one, huh? A true killer like me. The gods put us here to fill their halls with souls. You'll fit in fine down here. You want to talk to the king in rags? Fine. But first you gotta pay the toll. How about you get me a shiv? Not that I need one, but it's nice to have one in case I need to do some shaving. <laughs> hmm. Those eyes. All right, killer, go on through, but don't try anything. 
Modernock knows more than you think. Until next time. Well, well, look at you. Your kinsmen have turned you into an animal, Nord. A wild beast caged up and left to go mad. So, my fellow beast, what do you want? Answers about the Forsworn? Revenge for trying to have you killed? Your freedom? Yes, but even if you were to escape Sidna Mine, your name would still be stained with all that blood. You're one of us now, you see? A slave. The boot of your kinsman stepping on your throat. Maybe if you understood that, I could help you. There's a man named Bregg inside these mines. Besides me, he's been here the longest. Tell him I sent you. Ask him why he's here. I want you to know how widespread the injustice of Markarth is. Remember, it was the Nords who locked you up. You serve your time by digging, so dig. I was sent here because someone said I was a Forsworn. Don't... What do you want? My story, huh? Everyone in Sidna Mine has a tale. Let's hear yours first. When was the first time you felt chains around your wrists? So you know what it's like to have your life in someone else's hands. Why should they get to decide? Isn't judgment for the gods? Do you have any family? Anyone waiting for you on the outside? I had a daughter once. She'd be 23 this year. Married to some hot-headed silver worker, or maybe on her own, learning the herb trade. The Nords didn't care who was and who wasn't involved in the Forsworn Uprising. I had spoken to Modernak once. That was enough. But my little Aethra didn't want to see her papa leave her. She pleaded to the Jarl to take her instead. And after they made me watch as her head rolled off the block, they threw me in here anyway to dig up their silver. My daughter is the one who needs your pity. I'm just a poor Forsworn whose only regret is not killing more Nords before I was locked up. Till next time. You serve your time by digging, so dig. Do you remember the sun? Yeah, imagine hearing a story like that over and over. Each time a different family, each time a different injustice. Your meddling above ground reminded me of how removed I've been from the struggle. My men and I should be in the hills, fighting. Yes, but I need a show of loyalty from you. I don't need a shiv in the back while we break out. Have you met Grisvar the Unlucky? He's rightly named, and he's also a thief and a snitch. He's outlived his minor usefulness. Take care of him, and then we can leave Sidna Mine for good. Remember, it was the Nords who locked you up. Jarl just... What? No! No, don't kill me! Please! Oh, you suck oh well, this must have run off. That spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. That's 
spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. You're back! You've finally become one of us. Come with me. I think it's time I announced my plans to you and your new brothers. What's going on, Madinok? You wouldn't have old Grisvar killed unless you weren't planning on needing him. My brothers, we have been here long enough. It's time to leave Sidna Mine and continue our fight against the Nords. Through this gate, just beside my quarters, is a tunnel. A tunnel that leads right through the old dwarven ruins of Markarth, into the city. Well, what do you say, my brothers? The Reach belongs to the Forsworn! Forsworn! I say you've earned an early pardon. Let's go. Into the tunnel. Let's go.
Madunak, I've brought what you asked for. Good work. Get ready while I have a word with our favorite outsider. I had Kai recover all the things the Nords stole from you. You better get ready before we break out into the city. And take this. It's blessed with the old magics. Something to remember me by. Now, I announce to all of Markarth that I have returned. Don't worry about your name. They'll know who to blame and fear after today. It'll take years, but I'll organize the Forsworn again. We'll reclaim our land, and then when power is ours, we'll have peace. A kingdom. Until then, let me offer you a warning. Beware the Forsworn. No place in the Reach is safe from us now. I had Kai recover all... Madanak, think you can escape... I... Listen, do you? You'll pay for what you've done to my family. Your family? You've poisoned the Reach with your tainted silver for long enough, Thonar! Come on! You're a fool! 
Where'd you come from? Damn you! 